Well, I'm back to my Victoria 2 Lyon playthrough as it's 1920. As a great war is hopefully breaking out in Europe. I can only hope so. Uh-oh. Unless something... Pe really? Really? Right while I was about to say that a war is probably going to happen now because they add a goal on, I mean, goal on it. They white pieced out. Are you kidding me? Come on! I need a freaking war to happen already. Oh my god, I can't believe that. I can't believe they gave up like that. Get out of here. <sighs> Alright, so let's see. Any other naval base I can work on? Looks like no. Until I get that last Nash um, focus, that attack. Oh, here we go, maybe? Nope. And that's done. So it looks like almost all my naval bases... Oh no, there's still plenty more need to be worked on, but they got a while to go still. So, sucks my naval base can't be built up anytime soon until I get that next tech, which won't be till September. Shave the day off, I think, too. Man, I feel bad for whoever added that war goal because now they got all that infamy for nothing. Ouch. France has zero infamy somehow. What about the British? Zero. America, I don't think, was involved. They only have some infamy, but still zero, technically. Japan has none. Germany has less than one. Ooh, 14 for Russia. That most likely was it. Well, that just sucks. All that infamy for a white piece. Which is funny, since you added it on, I believe. So, what was that about? Since I can't see who else that infamy went for. You didn't get anything out of it. That was just dumb. Completely and utterly dumb for Rush for um, Russia and Austria to peace out. Especially since I need a great war to gain strength. Okay, so the jingoism of course. So let's see, I'm sixteen hundred no, China's sixteen hundred. I'm fifteen hundred okay, I'm within a hundred points again like I was earlier. But I need more ships in order to get up there, but I'm not building any more ships. Up oh, and the reactionary party won, which not a fan of, honestly, about that this time around. They do have limited citizenship, that's good, but I want... Wait, are we... A pro oh, Prussian Constitution. Okay, liberty is my own value. Yeah, I want to get the um, conservatives in power again. And yeah, we'll give you extended subsidies since we did the party that you didn't want. God, I'm losing a whole bunch of money now funding... Those factories being built. Not the, the um, ships, I mean to say. Artillery factory now in Omoria, I believe it said. Alright, so... It's only at level freaking two! Get out of here! Can't be that expensive! Alright, lower... Uh, yeah, no, let's, let's lower the taxes again. Alright, let's do that. At least, oh, no, I'm not making money again. Since I didn't know the tax were that low, I guess I'll get the poor up to 80%. Alright, so now we're in June, getting close to July. Let's check out the factories. Alright, so they're all doing good. My literacy, thankfully, is going up pretty good. 42%. These ships, at least all of them will be done by the end of November. But like I said in the last episode, it used to be, in my experience before, if you build ships, you still get um, military points from them, even if you are over your um, naval limit. That happened before numerous times where I do that to um, secondary powers of mine. As soon as they build a whole bunch of ships, I would just build well over the um, limit, and I'd still get enough the points needed to become a great power. But lately, for some reason, when I've tried it, it hasn't worked. So, I don't know what to say. It's weird. And can I build... I got a whole bunch of places that need to become states, but don't have enough bureaucrats to do it. And I probably don't have enough co accepted culture to do it either. Or colonial points. That's another thing, too. I think if you build over the naval base limit, you'll lose colonial points, too. That I know, but I've, I've seen it actually happen still. But the, na the um, strength for your navy, though, that's when it's still confusing me. All right, here we go. We're about to get, and I'm going to go for electricity now. So do that. All right, so now 
I can build more ships! Alright, so... Now that that's out of the way, let's start trying to build up my naval base limit. Of course, they cost almost 250,000 pounds each, so... Good luck being able to fund that anytime soon! You know what? I think I'm going to fund everything now, because I want to make as much money as possible. I need to badly make that much money in order to build as much naval base as possible. So, sorry, everyone. You're going to have to deal with higher taxes and a tear from me while until I get enough money to build up my naval bases. This is for the greater good of the Empire. Alright, so, oh my god, the Oman is so... Jesus, it's still slow! Come on! And, of course, they're still being worked... Okay, I already did that one. Alright, so... That one's still being worked on. They gotta get to level 4 before I get them to level 5 and then 6. Yeah, let's get Cuba out of the way, because that's, like, one of my few colonies out there. That's another thing, too. When are you gonna... When are people gonna start immigrating there already? So I can turn Cuba into a state. That's getting annoying, too. Look at that. I'm now the fourth strongest country in the world. Hey, I did it! Let's see. Oh, though, I'm in range, though. So I'm actually am getting points in my... Well, keep building ships! All I can do is keep building ships right now, because I'm on the verge. I am on the verge of being a great power. If I hold on exactly as this for another year without falling, I'll get it. I'm just going to have to go... Hell yeah, that'll help me too, getting some extra prestige. Because once I finally get become a great power again, I can start influencing countries I want to attack again, and that way they won't be sphered by anyone, so I can eventually attack them and take them over. At least that's the hopeful goal. And there we are, 1921. Alright, so that'll wrap up this episode. See you guys next time, as hopefully I'll keep making more money to build up my naval strength.